Hello everyone, this is Mock, and I'm here with another video about Last Fortress Underground. Greed is reaching unthinkable levels. We have a new car for our formations, but it won't be for just anyone, as it can only be obtained with money. I will share my thoughts about this, but before going on, if you like my video, don't forget to like it after watching it. You know, I'll be very grateful. The neon car is here, a kind of pimped sport car that like the armored chariot has a second weapon slot, in which goes the neon rear wing, with the ability called Windrunner, which grants a plus 10% initiative for two rounds. So far, this is another chariot for fast attack formations, meaning that are aiming for the heroes to have the higher luck and manage to make their attacks before the enemy formation in an attempt to finish the combat between rounds 3 and 6. How to get it? There is no other way than spending money, at least for now. The engines we have been collecting by killing zombies are useless for this chariot, as it requires these rare chariot components that can only be acquired through this 10 unit bundle at $99.99 or 1 unit bundle for $9.99 and 100 units are required to unlock the chariot. The other way will be to combine the current cumulative top-up event, which has 60 of these components in the last level. Of course, you will have to spend 2500 US dollars to get them, and you will be still missing 40 components, so no, it doesn't make any sense. The cheapest way to get it, it will be to use a combination of the in-game discount vouchers and Paxify but it looks a bit difficult. Hey, you can't miss this deal. Try Paxify for free and gain access to insane first deposit bonuses. Thousands of gamers have unlocked epic savings, leveling up to the top alliances. New players can try Paxify service for free with a $4.99 bundle, zero cost and zero risk. And that's not all. Paxify offers incredible first deposit bonuses. Take a look at this amazing offer. You can get up to $410 in bonuses. Click the link in the description box of the video to try Paxify for free today. But remember, this is a time-limited offer. Don't let this opportunity pass you by. Thinking about a scenario where we have already used the gold and silver vouchers, we only have the option of the bronze vouchers that we can get in the armaments race. With 10 of them, you could buy 10 bundles of 10 units at $97. Then you apply the 10% discount from Paxify and you will get the bundle for $87. You will need 10 of them, so in total, we will spend $870. The other option, and I know there will be someone out there who may have them, is if we have 100 bronze vouchers. Then we could buy 100 bundles of one unit at $7, which after applying the 10% discount from Paxify will leave us with $6.3 each. Finally, after having the Paxify team spending an hour making the purchase, we will get it for $630. But come on, how many people will have those 100 vouchers and also will be willing to spend $630? Do I think it's worth it? Not really. The attributes don't seem worth the price. Let's be honest. Fast attack formations are for those who spend money in the game. Otherwise, we will always find someone with higher luck in their heroes and our formation will attack after them with less defense. The wisest way is to go for the slow attack strategy, privileging damage mitigation and attack power. If you are one of those who can focus only in the main truck, I recommend you going for the Iron Fist or the New World Protector. Regarding the attitude of the developers, I think their greed is reaching levels that will end up killing the game. With events like Palmer and Soros, The Voice, and now this chariot, in which only those who spend big amounts of money can access the rewards, will make the zones end up being inhabited only by these big spenders. Maybe. We could imagine that the following War Beast will cannot be unlocked with the same blueprints of the Metallic Dragon, and also will can only be obtained by spending money. Who knows? I think now we can expect anything. A pity, because 
I have enjoyed the friendship of those with whom I have shared this time in Last Fortress. And it has been really sad when due to the level of money spending required to stay competitive, good friends have already decided to leave the game. Well guys, share your thoughts in the comments. As always, join my Discord and follow me in my other social media. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe to my channel and activate notifications so you know when I upload new content. This is Mock, I wish you all a great day, bye bye.